Hello guys and welcome back to the channel and in this week's review we're taking a look at the Transformers Constructicon Mixmaster number 53 from the Transformers Studio Series line. So here he is and first and foremost we'll always take a quick look at the packaging. So we're going to go ahead and maybe scoot him aside just a little bit. So here is the box here, number 53, Constructicon Mixmaster. Um, nice CGI image from there, a nice open window that fully showcases this big year. And on the side here we do have a image of Devastator here, along with um, Transformers in 21 different steps, along with uh, the alt mode and robot mode, includes a background. The Desert Sand Quick, as Constructicon Mixmaster combines with his comrades to form Constructicon Devastator. So then we have an up close CGI image of his face there. I'm, um, soon I'll be getting a little 360 degree angle thingy bopper when I get more like gear. So um, that's basically about it for the packaging, Revenge of the Fallen word and stuff and barcodes so guys that's it for the packaging so here we have constructicon mixmaster from the revenge of the fallen film this here is the head of devastator i think ultimately i really think that maybe they did pretty great i think they did great i just wish there was maybe a uh, a way to store the, this piece like this piece right here. Wish they had maybe like an available spot, but you could just put it back here like so. It looks okay. Looks okay. So sorry about that. Just trying to get a halfway decent thumbnail. Maybe I will do that later. But um, no, guys, this is Mixmaster Constructed Con for the Studio Series line. He is not a bad figure. Let's see, point this down just a tad bit, just a tad bit, there we go. So guys, this is actually uh, a pretty good piece of Mixmaster here. Um, I think he's pretty cool looking. Um, he's got big arms, obviously, as we can see. Big arms, big arms. I'm gonna post these up just a tad bit. So yeah, no, this is what he's supposed to look like. Um, so he does have that nice dark gray paint, as we can see. Along with some bit of silver painting. The head sculpt's really nice. Not too shabby. And let's see what else we got here. I mean, there's just tons to go on about this. I mean, it's a really well detailed Studio Series figure. Now, I believe in my scavenger review, we sh I showed off all my constructor cons. I, for some reason, the other ones were deleted. So I need to go redo those again. But no guys, I do like his little claws, or his big claws as you would like to call them, are pretty nice, not too terrible. Um, I really think that just maybe if they were to include like the gun that was supposed that he was supposed to come with in the movie, I really think maybe this figure would have made a excellent worth get your money's worth if you guys were to get like the weapon that you guys could get. Now, you can post this into its little weapon or cannon mode, but I will do that on my Instagram. Link in the description below for my Instagram and my Facebook page. You guys can find me there on my social medias. So, no, yeah, I really think that this figure, not bad at all. I really do like how everything turned out for him. I do like the stripes that they included here for the drum, for the robot mode. But no, guys, that's literally the side there. The, um, the legs are not too terrible. I mean, the chest sculpting's not terrible either. I think they did pretty good on that too. Um, I really think that it's not terrible. It's not terrible at all. Um, so guys, no. Just give you guys that 360 degree angle turn. Not the greatest, not the best, but you know what? It is what it is from this point. Yeah, there's his back. You can see Devastator's mouth right there. Let's go ahead and set that straight up. And yeah, that's Devastator's mouth, along with like um, a silver bumper, dingy bopper there. So yeah, no, let's go on ahead and get into vehicle mode. I will not be showing Devastator mode until we get all the constructed cons to form Devastator. That will be a really amazing review. So guys, let's go on ahead and take a look at 
alt mode. And here's Mixmaster in his most magnificent looking alt mode, or should I say vehicle mode. So it's pretty cool looking. I like how this figure in vehicle mode turned out. Everything rolls quite well as it should. Um, wheels are quite nice. It rolls really smooth. All wheels do turn. Um, as you can see that this was like, this is actually a quite nice, like mi mixing truck. It is quite nice how it looks. Um, as you can see, like in the movie, it's not a dog. It's actually a dog with a Decepticon head for some reason, but it does quite make sense because he is a Decepticon. And unfortunately I wish what they could have done is made this truck maybe have some battle damage or dirt on it. That, I think that's really what would have made the Constructicons really amazing looking, is if they added some dirt along with the Decepticon symbol in there. That'd be really cool inside. That way it really did look like the um, actual truck from the movie. It does have some nice stripes to the barrel, as I've said. You can see where his hands are right here. Along with, let's see, dark gray painting. Light gray, silver paint. It does have nice detailing. There's his head and feet and legs and all that cool jazz. Um, he does have some different stuff with it, but uh, I think it'll work. I think it'll work quite well. No guys, I, I think this figure really looks nice. You do have a little bit of like kind of bluish for the windows. There's the, I think the resting pipes, I'm not 100% sure, but um, nope, that's basically what you can do with this figure. So guys, I hope you guys did enjoy this video review. I hope to see you guys in my next review. Thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you guys, we are almost, we're actually getting close. Getting close to 400 subscribers, guys. This is just crazy. Literally, we've had a really amazing year on this channel guys i thank you all for the support to this channel thank you all for watching this video see you in the next one